Hi and welcome. In this video, we are going to see how to program a module for a Joomla website. So, to begin, we will create a new folder that will hold the files, and I will call the folder mod.ls. PLS for programming languages because what the module will do is uh, let the administrator uh, choose a language in the back end of the website, and in the front end, the module will display a sentence that describes or just uh, tells us something about that language and the sentence uh, will be stored in a database so let's open the folder and create a new file I will call the file mod bls.php okay then I will add another uh, file this time it's mod bls.xml okay and uh, another file uh, create table this is just for me uh, these uh, two files this uh, create table and the following one it's just for me to write the sql uh, commands to uh, create the table and insert data into the table so insert into table dot text okay now let's begin by programming uh, the XML uh, file. I never write XML uh, code so uh, but instead what I do is go and grab uh, from the Joomla website uh, the uh, website I have installed I will uh, grab the a file uh, from there and change it so it's uh, I always work with the login there it is so, uh, open this file and uh, control C close it control V and here I will change uh, just uh, some uh, values here so it's not login it's PL S programming languages so uh, the author is uh, of course me <laughs> again and uh, it's uh, John Yari and it's uh, first so it's the first day of the 2009 uh, year uh, open source okay the license is okay the admin at uh, test.org and the uh, e-test is just the name uh, uh, I gave the uh, Joomla website when I installed it so the author URL I don't have one so the big deal the version is of Joomla we are working with the version 1.5 and later uh, so here description description of the LS here's the login ls and here ls okay now the parameters I need uh, uh, two parameters okay I won't need all this okay I just need uh, a list okay it's here uh, name it's language uh, language default is PHP and libel is language description is select other the default is PHP the first option is PHP and the value is PHP okay we can write this in uppercase and let me just copy this control C control V here I will write JavaScript so the language is JavaScript 
and here uh, let's say um, C++ okay and here the name is uh, who so who said uh, something about the language the type is text not radio the default is admin and the label who said the description is who said it okay so that's all we need here to do in this XML uh, file so we have two parameters and we have our file and the uh, metadata the information about the author and uh, the module so let's save this save and close so uh, now we have created the uh, metadata let's now uh, create uh, a table okay it's fine i will just use notepad create table and the table will be uh, prefixed with the joomla prefix uh, jos because uh, i didn't uh, choose another prefix when i installed joomla and the table is just pls okay the table has the following fields the id which is an integer and it's uh, not null of course because it is a primary key then i have a, a language so the language it's uh, a var or let's give it just uh, 20 and it's not null then we have the comment about the language which will be displayed through the module so it's a text and it's not null it's that simple okay save this and now uh, to insert data insert into jos pls values and the values or the following so the, the first uh, record the first is one with the id one and the language is php and the comment is very good language okay then the second uh, record is for javascript javascript and the javascript is the de facto language of the web then uh, three uh, the uh, third language is uh, i think uh, ah c plus plus c plus plus and very nice language about a heart okay so that's for answer team okay 